All right, the Tao Te Ching. Probably one of the most fascinating books ever. Shrouded in mystery. Cryptic. Very hard to decipher. It's behind the words. It's like a parable. But it's it's kind of like uh, amusing and ironic and kind of like fun at the same time. It's like a tease in some ways, right? So it's kind of like the first stanza, which I was thinking about today and I wanted to talk about a tiny bit and just clarify something that some people are talk about in a way that's kind of like it's hypocritical because of the first statement on the first stanza. So the way that can be told, the tale that can be told is not the is not the real tale, it's not the eternal way. Okay, and the name that can be named is not the eternal name. Okay, so and I don't know if it's it's different translations. I think in a different translation it says something along the lines of those who know don't say those who say don't know. Now, it might be in another stanza. Let me have a look here one second. I think it's in a different translation. So that, that translation, those who know don't say, those who say don't know. And then a lot of people say, well, he said. So it means that he doesn't know, right? Well, this is what I want, wanted to say about it, is that he didn't say. He was leaving the town or the village where he lived. Uh, I can't remember the name of it. A couple of letters, I can't remember. Someone asked him when he was on his way out of the village because there was a war coming or something like that. And no one ever seen him again. But So he was asked. That's the point I want to make. He was asked. Somebody asked him. Obviously, they seen the way that he was living. Obviously, he was a man of great wisdom, power, love, compassion, strength, and a sharpness that most people just don't have. Also, I'd say mixed with a, with a, with a kind of like a dangerous side of him as well. Dangerous. Because that has to be mixed in with it as well. You can't be taken seriously if you haven't got a danger about you. I don't give a fuck what anyone says. If you have got no danger about you and it's all just love and kind of like, you know, peace and all the rest of it. If there's no danger about you at all, then it's bullshit. So those who know don't say. Those who say don't know. He didn't really say. He was asked by one of the guards as he was leaving the town to write something down, write his wisdom down on the book. So when, he, when someone asks something, it's different from you offering without anyone asking. I yield.